Awesome Jam David Torres, Real Trip second. Awesome Jam wins! He was definitely named appropriately, Awesome Jim. Awesome Jim trying to gun him down, and here comes Awesome Jim alongside and right on by. He was just one of those horses that, uh, and still is, it's a lot of character to him. Uh, he's just, he's a horse that's got a lot of will and try in him. Awesome Jim going to need a seam between horses. He might just make his own seam, and here he comes up into second. Ever since day one, I got this horse as a young horse. Uh, always been very willing and uh, workmanlike, and uh, he sure put it out there on the track each and every time. Awesome Jim alongside and being confidently handled by Alex Solis and he takes the lead. Awesome Jim to win. Uh, even the times when I don't, when I didn't rode him, uh, I remember Solis uh, he rode him a few times. There's times that he got beat. There's times that he he ended up winning the race. But it was uh, it was kind of different. His personality was unique. David and they were like like uh, he fit him like a glove he really did David rode him just about almost every one of his races and he was on it for his first start and uh, uh, in his last start as well his 52nd start in the day when he was uh, feeling the in his best it was unbeatable he was just gonna win he knew he obviously had the pedigree to go with it and uh, his confirmation the way he moved on the track we were always real pumped and, and high on the horse and uh, uh, he definitely didn't let us down all these years. Winning a race with that name, uh, that caliber, uh, beating a best horse in, in the, uh, that day, um, he gave me every single stride. I feel it. He was ready. They're off. That was definitely a highlight for myself and, of course, the horse. Uh, that race had been a kind of a nemesis for me over the years. Uh, I'd gotten uh, de disqualified one year, came back, got beat a nose one year. so. Having him come and be a seven-year-old and, and winning it was pretty special. Awesome Jim is next, top of the stretch. It's Campari trying to get the final furlong. Here comes Real Trip outside of Richard's kid. Awesome Jim could also do it any one of four in the Gold Cup. Real Trip takes the lead. It is Real Trip. Awesome Jim moves through at the rail. He's got a chance to beat him. Awesome Jim, David Torres, Real Trip second. Awesome Jim wins. The 71st Hollywood Gold Cup goes to Awesome Jim and David Flores. They beat Rail Trip by a neck. Richard's kid finished third. Just, just amazing what a horse can do. You know, to, to come back, to go to the winner's circle and um, uh, see everybody just with his hands up in the air and celebrating. You know, and um, all the rewards from all, all the time they spend just uh, trying to get them ready and, and give their everything that needs to be possible for, for, for him to, to get to those kind of races. And um, it was very special for all of us, especially for me too. This is definitely one of a kind horse and uh, I wish I had a barn full of awesome gems. If you're able to ever get your hands on a horse like this, you know, hey, good for you. Uh, so we're always out there looking for that, uh, that horse like him. Uh, again, these are some big shoes to fill, and uh, you know, if I could find another awesome gem, that'd be great, but he, he's definitely one of a kind. Oh, awesome gem is an awesome horse. I would love to get on with one more time. <laughs>